गाइस आई एम सुंदरेश कोड़ी एंड आई एम शशि दे आई आई एम इज दिनेश तिवारी टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू शो यू व्हाट इज माइक्रोसॉफ्ट लर्न एंड हाउ सो हाउ ऑसम इट इज ओके सो गणेश फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन uh can what is ms learn and can you tell the audience like what is ms learn how will you navigate through it hey okay. uh ms learn is a very typing thing if you if you are a beginner or you no know, anything want to learn anything tech related ms learn is a way to go uh made by microsoft and you can say it as a ms learn or microsoft learn and here you can learn almost anything that you want if you want to be a data scientist uh, there are parts so that if you want to be a developer there are parts so that if you're just beginning and you're a student there are parts so that if you want to get yourself certified and uh, there is a way for that also uh, you know uh, it is completely online and you can do at you know at your wish and your will so even if you wake up at 3 in the night and you want to learn something then i could have learned that so <laughs> uh, i don't know if that defines it well or you, you need me something more to say yes that's it okay then hey. i see we have learning paths and modules so what is the difference between a path and a module like right? okay oh oh Okay, so I think I should explain myself a little bit more. So, if you are, uh, you know, if you if you wake up at three in the night and you want to learn something tech and Microsoft Learn gotcha. So you you might be wondering as of how you want to start learning. So you know, I can just give you a glance of how those things. So this is this is this is the home page of Microsoft Learn. If you don't know how to get to it, uh, this is a short thing, aka dot ms slash learn. Yeah. If you if you run this line of URL, it will take you to Microsoft Learn, and this is the home page that you will be greeted with. It is the same thing as that. I just showed you how to go to it, and if you go to here, you can see there are learning paths and modules, and uh, you know it shows which are the favorite ones and what people. uh you use you can you there you can learn according to product so if you just want to learn about azure um there is something about it if you just want to learn something uh, related to a role uh, there is content for you uh, also if you want to get yourself certified we got you so okay so as i told you um uh, all of the stuff which is in you know like you learn um it is all divided into many different small modules and you know it might be confusing for you when you just start up as to what is microsoft learn and what all things it covers so i have a basic definition with which you can you know uh grasp all for all of it consider microsoft learn as a, you know a library so it has many books and each learning path consider it as a one book so uh how do you find the book uh, you just go to learn and and you are here and then you click on browse so ganesh uh i want to learn a spe- about a specific role where shall i able to find it like a specific roles okay so for specific role you can just go over here Uh, as you can see the first tab is about products but you want to learn about roles so here you go if you are a student uh, that i expect most of you are so you just click on it and it will suggest you roles that are for students so uh, how you you know you can learn some university courses or become a microsoft student ambassador or you know if you are an educator there are courses for you um, and also uh these are some modules and modules which are specified for someone who is a student and you know it it is all as you can see it is all beginner so even if you don't know anything uh it should be it should be a way for you to get started with it 
and if even if you are something more experienced like a developer so if you click on a developer uh, there are content for you uh, it is anywhere from a beginner level to an intermediate level uh, so to an expert level uh, i'm not able to see here anything but there are content for you so uh, this is all about learning part and uh, okay so i can delve in a little bit more and tell you about what is learning part in a module because you've been hearing both these terms quite frequently and you uh, you were not able to get it so uh, i will just go over here customize my part and and i will click on student okay next i i will select myself as a beginner i will select next and i want to learn something about azure so i will click on it and say next so and oh that's another thing that we need to talk about so whenever you are browsing to the you know ms learn you can directly click on a course uh, like this is this is my no this is not the sign part but if you if you are not logged in you can just click on any module and start learning it you don't need to sign in but if you want yourself to you know get some recommendation and you want to save your progress and so that so that you will need to sign in okay so here is a module and you can consider of a module as a chapter in thing so if i go here browse uh, there is an option over here uh, if i take it learning path it will only show me all the learning paths as in the beginning i told you like microsoft learn is a big library of books and in each learning path you can consider it as a book and in each book there are modules so there are chapters and inside each module there are lessons like if you consider this as a learning path each of these cards represent a you know a chapter and each of these things it will consider a topic or small thing i guess that will consider you know that will clear all of your doubt if you if you are logged in uh, you will see some progress let me just go into my logged in browser so if you see uh, i am i am in my logged in account if i just go here in my profile and here As you can see, I have completed few modules, and it stores all of my progress. Hey, can you just so, tell me, like, explain us what are these badges and trophies? Oh, I, I, are you are you talking about this achievement? Mm -hmm. Okay, ah, I got you. So in this overview page, it show it stores all of my progress, and you know, uh, like this this thing, like a long running function. If I if I start if I complete this module, if you can see. there is just one thing remaining summary so if i just you know unlock this achievement i will get a badge <laughs> so uh, as soon as you complete a module you get a badge and you know let me just see what all badges that i have so uh, okay i didn't actually unlock it so i i guess i unlocked it so i will go into my profile and here you can see achievements and badges here all of my badges will be visible so as you can see i have learned a lot and i have quite a few badges and after completing each module you get a badge but you know as as i said there are several different modules in a learning path if you complete a full learning path you get a trophy so as you can see i have three trophies here and couple of more on my personal account that i have so anything more that you want to ask so i have seen this courses okay i learned my course i learned my paths then is there any way that i could get certified in this service oh yes 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 ms learn has you know everything that you want to be certified as if you just go in here and you know, uh Go into the ms dot learn path, uh, okay dot ms slash learn. Uh, in this homepage itself, you will see an option of certification. So 
So you, you can browse certification. Like if you want to, you know, be certified in certain stuff. Like if you want to be certified in Azure, if you want to be Azure Architect, you can click on it and get certified. If you want to have a data fundamental certification, you can get certified. And you know, it's all inside MS Learn, so you don't need to go anywhere else. Uh, you click on any, you know, certification, you'll get this page. And you know, uh, for that, for getting a certification, you will need to take an examination. So, for That's each certification, you will need to take uh, an examination. As you can see here, I will need to take the Microsoft 365 Fundamentals exam in order to get this certification. So, um, if I click on download this thing, it will give me a you know outline as to what I need to prepare. In order to take this examination. Uh, okay, can I ask, like, uh, can you uh, explain me about Learn TV? Oh, yeah. did you hear about Learn TV? Where did you hear it? This is the latest addition to Mother of Learn. So, you know, if you just go on to the home page of MS Learn, that is like this. If you just go in, uh, it's taking the time. Okay. If you just go in, uh, there is a button in you know, Learn TV. If you click on it, it will load upon the thing and here Microsoft presents you with live educational content throughout the day so the learning never stops. So if you want, you know, this is like a kind of a TV which is, you know, running 24-7. So you can watch content over here anytime and learn some different things over here. So guys, that was a brief introduction about the MS Learn by Ganesh Tiwari. And if you'd like to know about uh, our platform and our community, you can watch the videos in the given below playlist. Awesome. Thanks for watching everyone. And don't forget about to like and subscribe to MS Inspire. Okay, stay tuned and we'll be back soon. Bye-bye.